Welcome to you in Stoa break time. Blockchain in construction. What do AI, machine learning, the Internet of Things and big data all have in common? Well, we hear about them non-stop from our news sites, our feeds, and everyone says they'll change everything we do, the way we work, learn, relax, drive. And every year, the hype gets hyped while the excitement gets, well, even more excitable. And yet, it's not happening quite as quick as we thought. We've been considering these technologies for years, of course. Make sure you check out our data page on the Instoa website. Big data has, whether we like it or not, though, changed the way in which we look at the world. In one aspect, Amazon is no longer seen as a simple replacement for the bookstore on the corner. It's a technology company. In the same way that we don't see Walmart as a simple one-stop retailer, it too is a technology company. We could argue some of these technologies are taking more than they're giving back, granted perhaps a controversial way of looking at it. But every day we contribute to the big companies' gigantic walled gardens of data. And even if you don't use Facebook or Instagram, remember that's owned by Facebook too of course, maybe you don't tweet or use LinkedIn. I'm sorry if you've got a credit card, you're feeding the beast too. When it comes to the Internet of Things, we know it's billions of things connected to billions of things. There is astonishing rapid growth in the amount of data generated today, and let's include machine learning in that too. As this trend continues, we will accelerate away from data manually entered by humans or from integrating with other systems. Now, let's throw a dash of AI into our mixing bowl. It's been coming for a long time, and it will get here, but as it matures, they're slowly uncovering and understanding large, previously unknown challenges. So where does blockchain fit into all of this? Well, don't worry, I'm not going to try and describe it right now. We'll include in the show notes an amazing TED Talk given by Don Tapscott. Now you could be forgiven for thinking blockchain is simply about cryptocurrency. But that would be like saying the movie Jaws was simply about a shark. Jaws was a genre-defining blockbuster that literally changed the face of modern cinema. And yes, it had a shark in it, but it wasn't about a shark. Okay, maybe Google that one. In the future, we see blockchain being in the fabric of everything. And right now, the concept of a smart contract is where it will all start. So where does this leave us? Well, we, as humans, in general, constantly strive to create order out of chaos. We use contracts today as a basic way of achieving this. The function and the concept is fully understood. Almost all projects have them. It's considered a mature technology. Blockchain smart contracts is a way in which we can 10x, 100x our ability to convert chaos into order. It will be astoundingly efficient. We'll spend less time collecting and manually entering data with the help of those billion IoT devices, of course. Then we'll backfill all that spare time with more considered decision-making, all driven by higher quality data. This, in turn, will accelerate the reduction of bias, which, as we know, feeds on the lack of data, low-quality data, and rushed decision-making. Furthermore, it opens the gateway for the application of new blockchains to other areas of chaos that need addressing in our industry. This is real progress. But if we're not prepared for it, if we don't embrace it, well, where does that leave us? There are so many other exciting technologies out there too, of course. The work they've done over at what three words location-based technology and the possible application for that. So perhaps as you've watched this and consider the possibilities in the future, we could focus on how we as individuals can make a difference. Yes, we all need to rework processes and contract relationships, whether you're an investor, owner, GC, contractor. But perhaps it's the individual who will lead this transformation. How do you work today? What could you change tomorrow? So it is in the fabric of everything. So you were prepared, so we're all prepared for the transformation coming. Don't forget to check out our show notes where you'll find links to some of the things we've talked about, plus a few extra. If you're not already, follow us on LinkedIn, Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching, but get back to work. Break time is over. I'm telling you, it's not about Bitcoin, I mean a shark.